This is where you make good money long term. <laughs> Morning. Jordan, what are we doing in Sydney? We are seeing Tom Panels. Your business is a reflection of you. We're having a personal training with Tom Panels and then he's going to be interviewing everybody as well. So it's going to be a good day. Get in there, I'm going to give you a cuddle. My name is Turhan. T-U-R-H-A-N. Turhan, are you Turkish? Turhan. Yeah, I'm Turkish. How do you know I'm Turkish? Because of the name? Yes. And I have a lot of Turkish friends. I have a Turkish friend, his name is Turhan. Yeah? Yes. You're much better looking than him. Yeah? <laughs> How long have you been driving taxi? Uh, nearly since 91. Tom Panos, NGU, Jordan Strudwick, Kurt Coburn, Steve at the 80s. Did I get it? Got it. If I can't get it right, who's going to get that name right? That's right, we're both Greeks, so yes. How are you? Great to see you. How are you? So pumped. We're harbour behind us. I don't know if you can see it, maybe you can't. We're at Cafe Sydney and uh, been having a training session, a leadership session. For me, goals, look, a better question for me than what's your goal? is what are you prepared to suffer for? What are you prepared? What are you prepared to suffer for, right? What are you, and they say, mate, I am prepared to suffer to get my house paid off. I'm prepared to suffer to give my kids a better education. I'm prepared to suffer. That's what you're looking for. What is someone, because there is suffering in real estate. There's a price to pay. So some people, some people aren't prepared to to pay the price of it. Do you understand what I mean? Yeah. Right, they're not prepared to do it, which logically doesn't make sense. But commercially, it's reality, because why isn't everyone in real estate making big bucks? Because there's a group of people that simply cannot handle rejection, cannot handle emotion management, cannot handle stress of people bullshitting to them, cannot handle have having to talk to strangers. So that is, that is. But what I find is if your goal is bigger than your than the obstacles, you'll make it in real estate, right? Mate, for me, I'm, I'm, I'm blessed because when I compare one suffering to another, like for me, hey, you gotta remember, for six months, I would, this, this, mate, if, 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 I could, if I could fucking live stream this now into the chemo ward to all those nurses, right? Because they, something was interesting they said, on April the 2nd, when I was my last session, one of the chemo nurses goes to me, hey, how you going, you good? How's, how's, how's everything? Having a good week, this and that? And he says to me, Tom, you're a different person. I never saw this, you're like, you're in good mood, that something happened. I said, Patrick, it's the last time I'm fucking coming here. <laughs> <laughs> He goes, oh, it's your last one. I said, yeah. Cut a long story short. That to me was suffering, right? I lose my iPods. They got them at RPA. It's an ongoing issue, but I lose my iPods. They ring me up. They said, we got your iPods here. I said, oh, don't worry about it. I said, I can't come in there. They said, oh... Why? I said, I don't want it. They're expensive. Yeah, I said, I know. I, I know what I paid for them. I said, oh, don't worry about it. I said, Steve, this is what I said to him. I said, I can't even drive down your street, let alone walk in there. They said, we'll, ha we'll leave it at reception. I said, don't worry, keep them. They said, we're not allowed to keep um, uh, lost goods. I said, do whatever you want, mate. I said, I'll go into the Apple shop. I'll buy them. And that's the end of the story. So for me, if you said to me, go speak to a thousand people in the next four days on the phone, I'll pick that over walking into um, a chemo ward. So what actually ha happens is one suffering teaches you to accept another suffering, right? So all you've got to keep looking at for is what, like look at Emil. Emil's a good story because Emil, 
Emil sees this as being a holiday. Emil sees real estate, you know, shooting video, recruiting officers, high, getting, getting, you know, big deals. Because where he came from, right, where you're constantly punched in the face every minute of the day, right, was suffering. And he sees this as being very, very easy. So that's why I always say, any day of the week, give me someone that's got an empty wallet, hungry stomach, broken heart. Straight away, give me that person. We'll just say these are the six or seven things you've got to do. You've got a chance with these people. You've got a chance with these people. Everyone good I know in real estate has come from some shit. Say that again? Everyone I know in real estate that is good at it has a fuck things happened to them in the past. Generally speaking. And they love this. They love it. See, I was a cop up for 17 years before I was a real estate agent. And to me, this is so fucking this easy. It's fucking crazy. It's easy compared to what I used to do. Well, you don't realize the cop is this fucking only work. No, it does work. All the shit. All the shit. But do you know what I mean? I mean? So for me, this, is, this isn't work. Like, I come to work every day, and I talk to people, and I negotiate a deal, and I get paid really quite, you know, handsomely for, for, the, for the privilege. But this isn't work to me. And that's why I've had so much success over the years. And this is even why I still actually love selling real estate 20 years down the track. Right. Because it's not work. Right. It, it's, it's enjoyable. I love it. I love the thrill. I love fucking competing. You know, I do. I love it. And I, I can't imagine ever doing anything different. So for me, sometimes like I look at other people, and even Jordan's the classic example. I used to keep saying to him, you'll never be successful in this until you commit. Stop worrying about what I list and what I sell. You can't do that unless you commit to this business. Once you commit, you can be better than me. And I say this to all my staff, there's nothing special about me. There's nothing you know, that sets, sets me apart from uh, other people other than I love what I do and I'm committed to what I do. Okay? So I want to be the best I can be. I want to get people the best possible price. I want to sell the house. And yes, I love the lifestyle of and it's fr and Steve, it's very frustrating when other people aren't like that. Mm. And one of the things that will going to save you a lot of disappointment in life, <laughs> a lot of disappointment, is one of the things that stresses people out is that they don't see the world the way you see it, right? And I've had to learn. It's taken me it's taken me years and years to learn. You know what management is? It's a beach ball. You know how beach ball's got different colored panels? Red, white, green, blue. There's a beach ball. You're looking at it. Your staff is looking at it. You both look at the beach ball. There's only one difference. They're looking at a green panel and you're looking at a white panel. You're both looking at a beach ball, but you see the ball differently from the way that you construct the world, right? So to answer, to, answer, to answer the question is understand people see the world not as it is, but as they are, and people are different to you. And it's gonna so, so, solve a lot of anxiety and stress because you keep saying to yourself, but what, doesn't he fucking see its value in this? Doesn't he see it's good for him? Eat your, like it's like saying, eat your broccoli, it's good for you. But they're thinking, I don't want the broccoli, right? And you can't understand that, right? That's what it's like. So all I've got to say is keep finding people that will understand the broccoli is good for me. The calls are good for me, you know? What a day. We just had a um, long lunch and four hour training with um, Tom Panos. Jordan, what do you think? It was amazing. It was amazing. I can't believe that. Um still feel surreal like not many agents would have the opportunity to get to I guess ask Tom in you know in a space like that just asking questions and go back normally you're in a big audience with a thousand people or something like that so yeah it's surreal awesome. I think we all have a different ways. I think the influential people always put a face on when there's a camera in front of them when you can have some real time with such an influential person that is being who they actually are you can ask real-time questions with a real-time person who's had real-time struggles. It's so much more beneficial than watching a video. Because we, we all do. We pop on a video, we put a front on. If you're on a video, you put a front on, you're on a video. You kind of act a little bit differently, so you are. You don't give away all of your secrets. 
you know, give away who you are when you've got one-on-one time with such an influential human being and they've let all of their barriers down to be who they are. You can't beat that. That's been definitely good for us. What do you think? Absolutely amazing. Um, to, to get that sort of opportunity, it's, for us it's probably once in a lifetime to get that sort of exposure. So, uh, and to get an insight from a man who's dealing with all of the best real estate agents in Australia and obviously now looking to take the show globally. Yeah. Un unbelievable. Incredible opportunity. So thank you. No, thank you. Thank you to all of us for being here. Another diff key difference between an NGU and a lot of the other brands, you don't get these sort of opportunities, right? No way. Never ever would you. No Plus, you've been eating a lot of food and oh. drinking a lot of <laughs> wine. Well, I'm still here. Yeah. <laughs> it's been definitely a good day. Definitely, definitely a good day. And we do love Sydney. <laughs> And Only for one day. <laughs> and what a day Sydney put on for us. Oh, oh it's just magnificent. 25 degrees, blue skies, hot chicks. Sign me up, baby. I'll be back tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Cut to the last part. <laughs> 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 so don't forget, I'll just put that